know how to start this to be honest. I ain't, I ain't with these makeup tutorials. I don't know nothing about nothing. Most people are like, oh my god, welcome to my channel. This is what i But. So I think it's finally time that I show you guys how I do my makeup. And I'm not, I've never been one of those like really big into makeup people. I can't even lie about it. I used to cry when my mom would put makeup on me, mostly because I was a tomboy when I was younger. But I think obviously I had to embrace it and um, kind of show you guys how I transform this into what you're gonna see. So let's get started. I'm gonna start with my eyes. So we're gonna start with this and I'm gonna be using the, I think my cat. Baby. Baby, look at you. Look how gorgeous you are. So I'm gonna start with this thing. As I said, I am not a makeup artist. I don't even know if I'm doing this thing right. I'm just doing it. So what I think I'm doing is just putting all of this all over the lid and I think that what it does is make it stick better or something. I don't know. But I'm just doing it because I saw you do it so I'm gonna do it. Then I'm gonna take this guy because it says shader on it and use s'more. Ah See, that's how you know I don't do this. Like, what? S'more, I'm gonna use s'more. I'm gonna eh, eh, s'more, right? Mm. And then just be like, oh no, let me do it how they do it. Right. And then I'm just gonna put that part over the lid. See, I'm gonna put that part over the lid. Am I covering this? Oh my God, all right, so I'm gonna just, and you know what, if I feel like it, I might put my Ariana Grande ponytail on. This might be my bootleg Ariana Grande look, to be honest with you. Work. And, ah, thing on my lid, whatever. Right? Crazy. Then, I get the one that says crease, and then I put it all up in latte. Sometimes if I feel like mixing it, I'm like, ah, 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 ah right? And then I just put it over the area where I think it should be. Oh no, y'all be seeing it from that. Mm-mm. Oh, look down. This is so weird because I never notice what kind of stupid faces I make during uh, the makeup process. So this is looks so amateur. Right? I'm so amateur. How ratchet they are. Oof. But this is smoke and mirrors. This is what we do. And then I'm gonna just horribly collide with a classroom. I would. So now I'm just gonna repeat that. Ideally on that side. So we're gonna get all up and s'more, like ah, ah, right? Right, baby? And then we're just gonna put it on. And smudge it all over the place. <laughs> ah, no! I, ah! I used the wrong one, no! So now I'm gonna use Stila or Stilla or whatever it's called. 
Um, Wanderlust. It's glitter. Eyeshadow. I'm doing. So I'm just gonna glaze that over. Personally, I feel like that's a very Ariana Grande thing, is the glitter lid, so it's kind of her thing. And it's just funny because I feel like people used to like not take her seriously. I used to think that she was always like really cute, but you know, that people would just be like, oh, she's like a kid or whatever. And I'm like, nah, I think she's dope, but I've always thought that she was cool. And that her voice, like she's so, She's crazy, like she could do with her voice, like um, being able to imitate people like that. I don't know if you guys have seen her imitations of like Celine Dion or uh, Christina Aguilera, Britney Spears, like any of those, Shakira, everybody. She imitates everybody. And she's really freaking good at it, it's insane. The only imitation that I can say I'm pretty decent at is the Nicki Minaj one, because a lot of people say I sound like her. That's only when I'm putting it on. Or when I'm mad, that's like when my accent comes off for real. And then I can kind of sort of imitate the Iconics. Terrible news, Peyton and I. Thank you, you have way too many tattoos on your body. Um, that kind of thing. Uh, oh, I can imitate Liv Morgan. Oh my God, she lived her life. Bro, uh, I was not expecting you to do that. <laughs> I don't know, bro. Like, what, what should I do, bro? I don't even know. Hold up, hold up. Okay, and then I'm gonna put this on. It's a uh, kind of like a highlighter-ish kind of thing. Um, it's called, it's from L'Oreal. It's called Brow Stylist Brow Razor Highlighter. So if I was gonna imitate Nicki Minaj, you're not gonna get it the first time. You're not gonna get the song the first time you hear it. After the second and third time, you're gonna be like, whoa. I, I was kind of sound like this because I felt like she's kind of bored because I have to deal with bums and just people who just don't understand and they just really, you know, they just, they irk me. They just, they really irk me. Now I'm going to moisturize with vegan milk moisturizer. Um, milk makeup, I guess. Blend. This is just something that I, because I moisturize anyway, but then this is something that I put on top of that. And then on top of that, I put this on, this Becca Under Eye Brightening Corrector. Um, but before I do that, I'm going to use Farsali Rose Gold Elixir. It's like this thing. Hold on. Come on. I'm going play with me right now. I'm going to play with me right now. See that? It's got like gold in it. So I just put it here, here, and here. Come on, wait. I'm running out, I gotta get more. But anyway, put it there. <laughs> but whatever. Anyway, so I just put this here to kind of like moisturize under my eyes even more. So I feel like that, uh, clearly, you guys have seen that I have bags under my eyes. Didn't do anything about it, I was born that way. And so after I put that on, I moisturize even more with this. I'm giving away secrets, y'all. Like, oh, I hate that. Cause then y'all people be walking around looking like me and sh All right. And then clean, they didn't get, you know, inspiration from nobody. Anyway, so it's this thing. This is like velvet. I is you not, it is like velvet underneath my eyes. So now I use my um, Fenty Beauty Foundation. It is, oh, Shake Wash, probably that. Take the 